Well, praise the Lord, praise the Lord. We like to say a big, big, big welcome to each and every one of you tonight. Those of you who are joining us for the very first time, how glad we are to have you with us. Those of you who are regulars, we don't take you for granted. Thank you so much for being here tonight. Those of you on Facebook, I see you coming up already. We welcome you. And we pray tonight will be a blessing to you. But please do me a favor. I'd like for you to help us share the program of tonight. Everybody needs to pray this prayer, folks. So those of you on Facebook, please take a minute and do that. And those of you on Spreaker, I want you to please do us a favor and send the link out also. Those of you on MixLR, you can do the exact same thing and let others know that we're right here right now, ready to pray, ready to call on God. Heavenly Father, we thank you for the opportunity to be together again. Thank you for protecting us since the last time we met in this place. Father, we pray that you give us the anointing to pray tonight and you will just help us to be able to put our hearts in what we pray about. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. All God's people everywhere said amen and amen. My theme for tonight remains as advertised on our publicity materials. You remember what it was? We are praying tonight on the theme that is titled From This Day. Yes, I got that from the scriptures. From this day. Actually, i like to add one more word to that. From this day upward. Yes, that's in the scriptures too. From this day upward. That will be our theme for tonight. Before we read our scripture, I want to remind you again. Help me spread the word and send the link out. Because this is going to be an eye-opener, especially tonight and tomorrow night. Just powerful, powerful, powerful thoughts and powerful prayer points from this day upward. Our text is in the book of Haggai, chapter 2. I'm reading there in verse 18 and verse 19. Haggai. Chapter 2, 18 and 19, it reads, Consider now from this day and upward. I love that. God said, consider now from this day, from today and upwards. I believe today is the 11th day of uh, August. And this is just going to continue forever. And for many of you, it's already the 12th day of August. Haggai chapter 2 verse 18, consider, consider now from this day and upward, from the 4 and 20th day of the ninth month, even from the day that the second foundation of the Lord's temple was laid, consider it. I love verse 19. Is the seed yet in the barn? The answer was no. They say yes. As yet, the vine and the fig tree and the pomegranate and the olive tree. No, they have not brought forth anything. But God concludes verse 19 by saying, From this day. Hallelujah. Will I bless you? Isn't that beautiful? God said it. He said, from this day, will I bless you? And you better believe when God says, I will do something, nothing is going to ever be able to stop him. So in this verse, God says, from this day, will I bless you? Let me read that verse 19 again. Is the seed yet in the barn? Yea, as yet the vine and the fig tree and the pomegranate and the olive tree 
hath not brought forth. But from this day, God said, will I bless you? You know, we just want to make a covenant with God tonight. We just want to reach an agreement with God tonight. By You need all the faith you can get. Muster your faith tonight to believe God. That from this 11th day of August 2022, or for many of you this 12th day of August 2022, or whenever you are watching or listening to this, from this day, God will not never before begin to bless you. Let me say two or three things before we pray tonight. Number one, Israel as a people who are devoid of the blessing of God in their lives, in their lives as individuals and in their life as a nation. Things were dried up because of one simple disobedience. They refused to lay the foundation and build the temple. That was the only reason. They were okay in all other areas. But this disobedience in their lives cut off the blessings of God. Well, that teaches me something. That one act of disobedience can shut your open heavens and destroy fruitfulness in your life and in my life. There was no seed again in the barn. And God said, yeah. There is no grapes on the vine. There were no figs on the fig tree. The olive and pomegranate trees had no fruits on them. Why? One act of disobedience shut the heavens up and destroyed all fruitfulness from them as individuals and from them as a nation. But, glory to God, when they realized their folly and started laying the foundation of the temple, God began blessing them. That's why he said, from this day, I can see now that you've taken everything ready to start laying the foundation of the temple. Then, from this day, will I begin to bless you. You know what really, really makes me happy about that verse? Listen to this. The building of the temple was not even finished yet. No. Just the commencement of the foundation, the blessing started. Once the process of obedience commences, the blessings commence also. Can I repeat that? At the risk of sounding redundant, once the process of obedience is commenced, the blessings will commence also. God said, oh, you started? Then from this day, will I bless you? That's why God said from this day forward, I will bless you. You know what my prayer for you is and what my, your, my prayer for you? for myself is that this day will mark a milestone in the history of your life. From this day upward, may God begin to bless all areas of your life. May you begin to see an upward trend in your blessings with no downward trend. In the name of Jesus. You know what I'm believing God for? For myself. And for all of you who are with me tonight. This is August. The month of new beginnings. Oh by the way I happen to know some of you on this prayer line. And you will not believe it if I begin to tell you. The new beginnings that many people on this prayer line are beginning to experience. This month of August. Month of new beginning. God will begin to bless you in ways that you can never, never, never imagine. I'm not going to talk much tonight. Can we jump into prayer? Because I got quite a few of them to pray with you tonight. Let's go before God with thanksgiving. Let's go before him with praise. Let's get, go before him with adoration. Thank God. Thank God for allowing you to see another week and another day to call on his holy name. 
Father, we bless you. Father, we worship you. Father, we adore you. Father, we glorify you. Thank you for allowing us to see another week and another day to call on your holy name. We bless you. We worship you. I want you to thank God that you are not tired yet of these prayers. Glory to God. Father, we just thank you because you've kept our interest up in praying your scriptures, in praying your word. And we thank you for the many testimonies of the great things that you have done and that you are doing and that you will yet do. Come on, let's give him praise. Let's give him glory. Let's give him honor. Let's give him majesty. Thank him for the prayers of last week. Oh, the short beds that he lengthened and the narrow sheets that he we widened. We need to bless the name of the Lord for that. Only God could have done that, and we thank Him for it. We praise Him. We praise Him for lengthening our short beds and our narrow sheets that He widened for us. Glory be to His name. Come on, bless Him. Come on, worship Him. Come on, adore Him. Come on, glorify Him. Father, I will praise you from this day. Something is going to happen. Oh, I wanted to thank Him for the theme of tonight and His promise to begin a new thing with us. That's why he said, from this day, from this day, we are, I just want you to really muster your faith tonight. Uh, I want you to thank him in advance that, Lord, tonight, 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 your promise to begin a new thing, to begin new blessings, to pour in new graces into our lives will begin to manifest in the mighty, 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 mighty name of Jesus. Thank him because this day will go down, yes, in the history of your life as a day that God began to bless you like never before. I wanted to give God a praise for that in advance that this day, this month will be a month of new beginning for you. Look what the Lord has done. Look what the Lord is doing. Look in the horizon and don't you see what God is about to do for you? Thank God because this day, this 11th day of August or 12th day of August, whatever the day is, where you are watching or listening to us from, will go down. Say, Lord, I just claim it that this day will go down in the history of my life as a day when a new beginning started, when new blessings flowed into my life. Come Come on, we praise you, we worship him, we adore him, we glorify him. Thank him because all small and big types of disobedience that are hindering your blessings, God will remove them from you tonight. And God will remove them from me tonight. They are the little, little foxes that destroy our vine of blessings. We want you to thank God in advance that whatever is destroying your blessings, whatever is withholding rain from falling upon you, upon your finances, upon upon your health, upon your marriage, upon your ministry. God is going to deal with them tonight. Thank him because all small and big types of disobedience were that are hindering us. It was as simple as laying the foundation of the temple. And God said, if they don't do it, they will not be blessed. The moment they started doing it, they started getting blessed. I want you to thank him for ushering you right now into a season of fruitfulness. Yes, that's what we are entering into, people. We are entering into a season of fruitfulness beginning tonight in the name of Jesus. Father, I bless you. Father, I worship you. Father, I adore you. Because a new season of fruitfulness, a new season of seeing seeing results will begin to take place in my life from tonight onwards in the name of Jesus. Pray that God will forgive you of any past or present disobedience in your life. Disobedience is bad. Oh, it will hinder blessings. Say, oh Lord, I just pray that you will help me. You will forgive me, oh Lord. Any disobedience in the present, any disobedience in the past in my life that can hinder my prayers, I pray that you will cleanse me with the blood of Jesus. Come on, open your mouth and pray tonight that the Lord will wash you, the Lord will cleanse you, the Lord will will purge you, the Lord will purify you, whatever the form of disobedience is, that the Lord God Almighty will use the blood of Jesus to wash away all disobedience from your heart and from my life. I want you to pray that all partial obedience will be destroyed from your life.
life in the name of Jesus. Say, O Lord, let all partial obedience be destroyed from my life and let it be replaced by complete obedience in the name of Jesus. Papa, take away from my life, extinguish from my life every form of partial obedience. You know, you can obey God partially and then walk in disobedience for the rest. But we are going to pray tonight that all partial disobedience in our lives, the blood of Jesus will remove them. The blood of Jesus will cleanse them. In the name of Jesus, Father, cleanse me tonight. In the name of Jesus, of all partial obedience. Partial obedience is as good as disobedience. I want you to pray whichever area that you are disobeying God and in the process closing the door of blessings against your life. The Lord will give you the strength to arise tonight and begin to walk in obedience in the name of Jesus. I want you to destroy all partial obedience. See every wall of partial obedience in my life. Every wall of disobedience in my life. Everything that my flesh says, yes, I want this. I want to disobey God. Father, destroy them from us tonight. Approve them from us tonight. Deliver us from them tonight in the name of Jesus Christ. I want you to pray that your faith, your faith, oh God, let my faith hold on to God for his blessings to commence in my life tonight. Oh Lord, we need faith tonight. So if God says I'm going to do this, then you need faith faith to claim it. Say, oh Lord, my God, in the name of Jesus, let my faith hold on, hold on to God for his blessings to commence in my life from tonight. In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, Father God, oh God, let my faith hold on to you, oh God. Let my faith hold on to your blessings, oh God. Let your blessings commence in my life. Let me believe you that from tonight, oh God, your blessings will come in my life, that I will go to bed blessed, that I will wake up blessed in the name of Jesus, and I will, and it will go on upward, upward from this day upward in the name of Jesus. Pray that your faith will hang on to that, your faith will hold on to that in the name of Jesus. Father, let my faith hold on unto God for your blessings to commence in my life right now in the name of Jesus. Not after I finish praying this prayer, while I'm praying this prayer. I I pray, Lord God, that your blessings will commence in my life. Say, Lord, I believe you. Say, Lord, I believe you that as I pray these prayers tonight, in the name of Jesus, blessings will commence in my life in the name of Jesus. I want you to say, I rebuke unbelief from my life. Say, I rebuke unbelief from this gathering tonight, in the name of Jesus. We need all the faith for tonight's prayers, people. So let's rebuke unbelief from our midst. Let's rebuke the demons that cause unbelief and doubt. The demons that say, well, you can never get it. You will never get it. Papa, we rebuke them. We reject them. We cast them out of our ways. We cast them out of our lives in the name of Jesus. All unbelief, all doubt, all double-mindedness that whispers in our ears that God cannot do it and God will not do it. And even if he does it, we cannot receive it. We reject you in the name of Jesus. We reject all unbelief to tonight, O oh God, in the name of Jesus. We reject all unbelief from our gathering tonight, in the name of Jesus. Say, I believe God. Come and say, say, I believe God. Come and say, say, I believe God. Say, I trust God tonight, that my blessings co commence, commence tonight, that my blessing will commence tonight, that my blessings will commence tonight, in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus. Something new is going to trigger for you this month of August, my friends, in the name of Jesus. I feel it. I feel it. I feel it. In the name of Jesus, I rebuke unbelief from my life. I rebuke unbelief from my life and from the lives of everybody on this prayer line tonight. We shall trust God. We shall believe God to see his goodness, to see his blessings among us tonight in the name of Jesus. Can I ask you to pray for grace to concentrate, grace not to be distracted from your 
your prayers tonight. Uh, tell the Lord to give it to you, give it to you, give it to me, give it to us, give it to you, give it to me, give it to us. Uh, grace, grace to concentrate uh, and not be distracted. Uh, we are here for a reason. We are here for a purpose. Uh, may God give me grace. May God give you grace. Uh, I said, may God give us grace to concentrate uh, and not be distracted. Uh, that sleep will not come. Uh, that telephone call will not come. Uh, that will do- knock on the door will not come to hinder us. Uh, Papa, help us to concentrate on why we are here tonight uh, to pray, uh, to seek God uh, for new blessings. Hallelujah. Don't you need new blessings in your life? I do need new blessings in my life. Uh, and that's what we are going to pray for tonight. Uh, pray that the Lord will always help you. Let's begin with the path of obedience. Uh, say, oh Lord, always help me. Come on, pray, pray, pray tonight. Uh, say, oh Lord, always help me, oh God. Uh, always help me, always help me, always help me. Uh, in the name of Jesus to walk the path of total obedience. Uh, help me to always walk the path of total obedience. Uh, in the name of Jesus, that was what took away the blessing of Saul. Oh, he went and obeyed God by going to fight the Amalekites. Uh, but the little details, he left them out. Uh, and God said, I'm not going to bless you anymore. In fact, I'll take the kingdom away from you. I want you to pray, Lord, help me, help me to always walk. Uh, help me to always walk. That's what destroyed... Mm, Ananias and Sapphira, uh, they should have kept the money instead of bringing half or instead of bringing part. And then they said, we brought everything. That is partial obedience. Uh, and he took the blessings away from them. I want you to pray tonight. Uh, say, oh Lord, no matter what it will cost me, uh, no matter what people around me will say, oh God, uh, help me to always walk the path of total, total, complete obedience. Uh, in the name of Jesus, help me to always walk uh, the path of total obedience, the path of complete obedience. In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus. Father, touch me, touch us. Father, touch me, touch us. Everybody on this prayer line tonight uh, that will begin to walk like never before. The path of total obedience to your word. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Uh, can I ask you to ask for forgiveness again? Say, my father, my father. Say, you are a forgiving God. Oh, where I have deliberately disobeyed you. Uh, where I have unknowingly disobeyed you. Uh, Papa. I ask for total forgiveness tonight in the name of Jesus, uh, of deliberate disobedience, uh, of unknowing disobedience. uh, In the name of Jesus, whether knowingly or unknowingly, oh God, uh, I plead the blood of Jesus tonight. Uh, I plead the mercy of God over my life tonight. Uh, I hope you are praying where you are tonight. Uh, I hope you are calling on God tonight uh, and saying, oh Lord, uh, forgiveness is what we ask for tonight uh, in the name of Jesus. Jesus, uh, where we have deliberately disobeyed you, uh, where we have in- unknowingly disobeyed you. Uh, Father, forgive us, forgive us, forgive us, forgive us, forgive us. Uh, in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus. Uh, I want you to pray a prayer tonight. Say, Lord Jesus, uh, give me the grace, give me the grace, give me the grace to correct. Uh, give me the grace to correct uh, whatever I need to correct uh, in my relationship with you in the name of Jesus. Uh, Israel corrected it to they went and they laid the foundation and God said you laid the foundation now you are ready to be blessed from this day upwards I'm blessing you I want you to pray whatever 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 you need to correct in your relationship with God grace will be given to you strength will be given to you might will be given to you in the name of Jesus whatever needs to be corrected in your in your mind in your heart in your character in your whatever the Lord will give you grace to correct them, correct them, correct them, correct them. If you have never heard my sermon on character counts, it's on, it's on the podcast. I want you to go and, wa- and listen to it. God will bless you from me. And I want you to pray, Lord God. It's those things that hinder the blessings of God in our lives. They hurt us at the throne of mercy. I want you to pray, oh Lord, whatever is wrong in my character, whatever is wrong in my life, I pray the blood of Jesus will wash me and cleanse me and purge me tonight in the name of Jesus. Whatever habit I have formed over the years that are destroying my life. Oh Lord, I plead the blood of Jesus. Father, I plead the blood of Jesus upon my life. Wash away all disobedience in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Deliberate disobedience. Oh Lord, unknowing disobedience.
disobedience. Papa, let them be washed, let them be cleansed, let them be washed, let them be cleansed, let them be washed in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. I want you to pray for total death. Did you hear what I said? Total death. Say, oh Lord, I'm praying tonight for total death to all little foxes that are spoiling my tender blessings. Oh God, the little foxes that are destroying uh, the tender blessings of God in my life. Uh, I command you to die. 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 All little foxes uh, that are going into my vine, uh, that are destroying the tender blessings in my life. Uh, come on, be destroyed. Uh, come on, be destroyed. Uh, Father, whatever the little foxes are, they may be my little pets. Uh, I love them so much. Uh, I enjoy them so much. Uh, but they are destroying the tender blessings of God in my life. Father, tonight you have my permission. Destroy them in your omnipotence. Destroy them in your mighty power. Destroy them. Oh Lord, total death, total death, total death, total death to all little foxes that are spoiling my tender blessings. In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, all the blessings in my life that have been broken and taken off because of these little foxes that are alive in my life. Uh, these little things that I allow in my life, they are not little, oh, because they hinder the blessings of God. Uh, say, oh Lord, uh, oh God, kill them, kill them, destroy them. Uh, I give you the permission to kill them uh, in the name of Jesus. Uh, Father, don't only remove my cobwebs. Uh, kill the spiders also in the name of Jesus. Uh, I said, oh God, will give you the permission. Uh, don't only remove the cobwebs. Uh, kill the spiders that are making the cobwebs in our lives. Destroy the little foxes. Papa, destroy the little foxes. Papa, destroy the little foxes that are spoiling the tender, tender, tender blessings, tender vines in our lives. Oh God, in the name of Jesus, answer prayer, Lord. Papa, answer prayer, Lord. Papa, answer prayer, Lord. I want you to pray. I want you to pray. I want you to pray. I want you to pray tonight that whatever God wants you to do, whatever step God wants you to take, he will show you and you will do it like the children of Israel did. Honestly, people, it may just be one simple thing. One very simple thing that God wants you to do and you will get your breakthrough. But as long as you hold on to it and don't do it, you will not get your breakthrough. I want you to pray, Lord, whatever you want me to do, oh God, whatever step you want me to take to get my blessing. Many of us are looking for blessings here, blessings there, blessings in the front, blessings in the back. Blessings in the home, blessings on the job, blessings, blessings, blessings. I want you to pray tonight, whatever it is, oh God, that I need to do, as simple as laying the foundation of the temple. Papa, show me, show me, show me, show me in my own life, whatever it is, oh God. I'm not bothered tonight about other people on this prayer line. I'm bothered for myself, whatever it is in me, around me, about my life that I need to take care of, that I need to pay attention to. Father, touch me, help me, touch me, help me to do whatever I need to do, uh, to take whatever step I need to take uh, in order for your blessings to begin to flow in my life from this day upward. Uh, in the name of Jesus, uh, in the name of Jesus, uh, people is not in the hand of God, is in your hand. Uh, people is not in the hand of God, is in my hand. Uh, oh Lord God, I give you my hand tonight. Uh, say, oh Lord, I give you my hand tonight. Uh, whatever is there, oh Lord, that I'm holding holding on to that is hindering your blessings. Papa, snatch it from me, O oh God. Papa, take it away from me, O oh God. Whatever little pet I'm holding on to, whatever little fox I'm holding on to, whatever it is I have to give up in order to be blessed. Father, touch me and help me to give it up tonight. In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, whatever foundation I need to lay, whatever temple I need to build, whatever it is, O oh God, you know what it is in my life. I may not even know, but if I know, oh God, push me into doing it. In the name of Jesus, whatever, whatever you want me to do, Lord, I'm ready, I'm ready, I'm ready, I'm ready, I'm willing. Say, oh Lord, whatever you want me to do, I'm ready, I'm willing. I'm ready, I'm willing to do it, oh God. Israel did it, and God gave them a fantastic blessing. He said, from this day upward, I will begin to bless you. Father, whatever it is I need to do, come on, open your mouth and pray tonight. Say, Lord 
Jesus, uh, whatever I need to do that will increase me, uh, whatever I need to do that will make you begin to bless me from this day upwards, uh, Papa, whisper in my ears, uh, Papa, show me in a dream, in a vision, uh, Papa, show me in your word, uh, in the name of Jesus, whatever it is that is hidden from me, uh, whatever it is that I thought is right but is wrong, uh, Father, show it to me, show it to me, show it to me, show it to me, whatever God wants you to do, I want you to pray, Lord, show it to me and give me the grace to do it. Father, show it to me and give me the grace to do it. And I want you to pray, oh, say, oh, Lord, as I commence obeying, as I commence doing it, let your blessings automatically commence in my life also. In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, as I commence obedience, let your blessing also commence. As I start walking in total obedience, let your blessing also begin to flow in my life. In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus. Has God told you what it is? Have you made up your mind to do it? Even before doing it at all, that you have made up your mind that you are going to do it, the blessings will flow tonight. In the name of Jesus. Say, oh Lord. Say, from this day upward. Say, from this day upward. Say, oh Lord, from this day upward. Mention today's date. I don't know what today's date is where you are. For me, it's August 11. For you, maybe August 12. Maybe it's September, somebody will watch this or listen to this. Say whatever the day it is, oh God. But from this day upward, Lord, begin to bless me. Begin to bless me. Begin to bless me. Begin to bless me. Come on, open your mouth. Open your mouth. Pray, 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 pray. What you ask for is what God will give you. Oh, say, oh Lord, from this day upward, begin to bless me, Lord. 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 From this day upward. From this day upward. Upward. We have promised God obedience, so we have made up our minds we are going to walk in obedience. Nothing can stop your blessing now. No witches, no wizard, nobody can stop your blessing. Say, oh Lord, from this day on, in the name of Jesus, begin to bless me, begin to bless me from this day upward. Come on, that's what God said. We are simply praying what God promised. Say, oh Lord, from this day upward, from this day upward, from this day upward, begin to bless me, begin to bless me. Now begin to mention what areas you want God to bless. From this day upward, oh Lord, begin to bless my finances. From this day upward, oh God, begin to bless my health. From this day upward, oh God, begin to bless my business. Begin to bless my ministry. Begin to bless my children. Begin to bless my family. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Put a point on today. In the name of Jesus. Today is our day of covenant, my people. Say, oh Lord, begin to bless me from this day upward. Begin to bless my finances. Begin to bless my health. Begin to bless my business. Begin to bless my spiritual life. Begin to bless me with gifts of the Spirit. In the name of Jesus, begin to bless my ministry. Begin to bless my children. Begin to bless my family. Begin to bless everything I lay hands on from this day. From this day, begin to bless me. Come on, repeat that as much as you want to. And mention those things that you want God to bless you with. In the name of Jesus, you need a car? God can bless you with one. You need a house? Maybe you have abandoned the building of your house. From this day onwards, the building of that house can resume and it will resume. What do you want God to begin blessing you with? You passed an exam or you failed an exam? Whatever you want. From this day onwards, let me begin to do well in my academics. In the name of Jesus, let me begin to do well in my sports. If you're a sportsman or sportswoman, whatever area you want God to begin to bless you, open your mouth and pray. Say, Lord God, begin to bless me from this day on. In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus. Can you ask, and I ask you to pray, your blessings are somewhere. They have been held up. I want you to pray wherever, wherever, wherever my blessings are. Whatever has held them up. Come on, pray, pray, pray tonight. Say, oh Lord, where Wherever my blessings are and whatever has held them up, oh Lord, release them one by one, release them every one, release them one by one, release them every one, in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, say wherever my blessings are, oh God, in the name of Jesus, some of you, your blessing actually is in the business you are doing and God really wants to bless that business, I 
as long as you begin to walk in obedience to him, say, oh Lord, whatever, wherever, whatever, wherever, whatever, wherever, whatever, wherever, whatever are my hell blessings, wherever they are, oh God, and whatever they are, oh God, some of you don't even know what your blessings are. Tell God, say, whatever my blessings are, wherever they are, whatever they are, wherever they are, Lord, release them, release them, release them, release them tonight in the name of Jesus. Release them one by one. Release them. And don't fall asleep. Oh, sleep is taking you. Ah, you better get up and pray. Say, oh Lord, whatever, whatever the blessings are, wherever the blessings are. You know, sometimes you think it should be this when God actually wants it to be that. I want you to pray, say, whatever the blessings are and wherever the blessings are, release them to me, oh God. Release them, every one of them. Release them, oh God, one by one. I want you to pray, whoever has been allowed, yeah, yeah, whoever has been allowed to sit on your blessings now that disobedience is in the past. Oh Lord, force them to stand up and let me be a recipient of my blessings. Whoever is holding them up and they think they have power. Whoever is tying them up and they think they have power. They don't know it's my disobedience that is giving them power. Oh Lord, I promise you I will walk in obedience. I will walk the straight and narrow path. Oh Lord God, wherever they are in the name of Jesus, get them for me. Whoever is sitting on them, force them to stand up. Whoever is holding them, force them to release them. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. God said from this day upward. I love that. From this day upward. You know what God said? All the fruits that you don't see, you'll begin to see them. The fruit that you don't see, you'll begin to see them. Say, oh Lord, from this day upward, this 11th day of August, this 12th day of August, or whatever day you are listening to this, say, my Father, from this day upward, bless me with uncommon fruitfulness, uncommon fruitfulness in all areas of my life. Father, from this day upward, let me begin to see uncommon fruitfulness. I want to be fruitful in the name of Jesus, fruitful Fruitful in the womb, fruitful, O oh God, in, in, in my marriage, fruitful, O oh God, in my ministry, fruitful, O oh Lord, in my finances, fruitfulness, O oh God, in my business. From this day upward, bless me with uncommon fruitfulness. And when I say uncommon, I mean uncommon. The one that people have never seen, the one that people have never perceived. From this day upward, Lord, bless us with uncommon fruitfulness in all areas of our lives, O oh God, in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus. I want you to pray that your vines, in the name of Jesus, will have grapes. Your olive trees will have olives. Your pomegranate will have fruit. In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus. Oh Lord, no matter the level of my blessings right now, are you praying with me tonight? Say, oh Lord, my Father, no matter the level of my blessings tonight, oh Lord, upgrade me tonight. Upgrade me tonight. In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus. Yes, I know you are blessed. There's no one on this prayer line that is not blessed. But you have not seen blessing yet. You have not seen blessing yet. You've got number 20 blessing. And God is taking you to number 2,000. Now upgrade me, upgrade me, upgrade me, upgrade me, upgrade me, upgrade me. Come on, open your mouth and talk to the Father tonight. Say, oh Lord, no matter what level I am right now, no matter what level of blessings, you know what I found out? No matter how blessed you are. There's somebody who is more blessed than you. So you can still move up. There are human beings like you. Whatever your trade is, whatever you are selling, whatever it is you are doing, there's somebody ahead of you and God can make you catch up with them and pass them. Say, oh Lord, no matter the level of my blessings, no matter the level of my financial blessings, whatever it is, oh Lord, I plead for an upgrade tonight. An upgrade tonight. Let him move upward. Papa, let my blessings move upward. Upward in the name of Jesus, pray, 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 pray tonight. Ah, pray tonight. Say, oh Lord, no matter the level, I want you to increase it in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus, let's come against the virus. Let's come against the virus. Say, oh Lord, extinguish them, extinguish the virus that may be on rampage in any area of my life. Those that are turning 
off the flow, hallelujah, the flow, the flow, the flow, the flow of blessings in your life. They are the extinguishers. They are the devourers. Oh Lord, I come against all devourers against my blessings. I come against them, oh God. They have no right now to operate in any area of my life. Whatever causes have been spoken that my blessing will not get to a grade or pass a grade, I cancel you, I destroy you. Those that have cursed that my anointing will not move beyond the level, I destroy your curse. In the name of Jesus, Papa, let your blessing be so much that curses cannot stand in its way, that spells cannot stand in its way, that jinxes cannot stand in its way. In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, I hope you are praying where you are tonight that the Lord will destroy all devourers, that the Lord will devour devourers. I hope you are praying with your faith tonight. Say, oh Lord, all devourers in my life, devourers of my health, devourers of my finances, devourers of my business, Papa, destroy them. Papa, destroy them in the name of Jesus. Let them not be able to operate again against my life. Come on, pray, 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 pray tonight. Death and destruction in the name of Jesus. Everybody say death and destruction in the name of Jesus. Say death and destruction. Come on, open your mouth and pray. Say I pronounce death. Say I pronounce destruction upon all locusts, upon all canker worm, upon all caterpillars, upon all palmer worms that have destroyed my blessings. You must die in the name of Jesus. You must be destroyed in the name of Jesus. Everybody say fire, 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 fire tonight. Oh Lord, fire, 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 fire tonight. Oh Lord, Holy Ghost, fire, Holy Ghost, fire. Holy Ghost, fire, Holy Ghost, fire. Holy Ghost, fire upon all locusts. Holy Ghost, fire upon all canker worms. Holy Ghost, fire upon all caterpillars. Holy Ghost, fire upon all palmer worms that are destroying my blessings. You know, I'm talking spiritually now. You know, I'm praying spiritually now. Oh Lord, send fire. Oh Lord, send fire. Oh Lord, send fire. Holy Ghost, fire. Send fire to destroy completely, to consume completely, to burn down to ashes all locusts, all spiritual locusts, all canker worms, all caterpillars, all palmer worms that have been sown into my blessings. And you get it, but they consume it. You get it, and they consume it. You see the fruit coming, and then you go back to the field the next day. It's all gone. It shall no longer be your portion. Fire of God. Fire of God. Fire of God. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Papa, fire, 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 fire. Papa, fire, 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 fire. Papa, fire, 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 fire. Oh Lord, upon all locusts, upon all canker worms, upon all caterpillars that are destroying my blessings, that are ruining my health. Destroy them. Papa, destroy them wherever my blessings are. And this Paul Lucas, these canker worms and caterpillars, they have said they will eat it all up. Fire, eat them all up. Fire of God, eat them all up. In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus. Everybody say, Lord, reverse them, reverse them, reverse them. Come on, pray, pray, pray. Say, Lord, reverse, reverse, reverse. Say, Lord, reverse them. All the evil that these armies have done to my blessings, reverse them, reverse them, reverse them, oh God. All the evil that the locusts, all the evil that the canker worms, all the evil that the caterpillars and the palmer worms have done to my blessings. Papa, reverse them, restore them, reverse them, restore them. In the name of Jesus, can I ask you to pray that all your blessings that have been eaten, all your blessings that have been consumed, the Lord will restore. Everybody say restoration, 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 restoration. Papa, let there be restoration, O oh Lord, for all our blessings that have been consumed, for all our blessings that have been eating up. Say from this day upwards. Hallelujah. I love that. I'm not the one who said it all. God said it. He said from this day upwards. I, I, I want you to pray. Say, oh Lord, from this day upwards, from this day upwards, from this day upwards, let my floors be full of wheat. Let my stores begin to overflow with oil and wine in the name of Jesus. Abundance, 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 abundance. From this day upwards, oh Lord, from this day upwards, let my floors be full of wheat. Let my stores begin to overflow with wine and oil 
in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, from this day upwards, this 11th day of August, this 12th day of August, or whatever day you are listening to this and praying this, from this day upwards, there must be a change. Can I ask you to pray with faith tonight? Can I ask you to pray with confidence tonight that God is able from this day upwards, let my floors be full of wheat, let my stores be overflowing with oil and wine in the name of Jesus. Say, oh Lord, from this day upward, come on, pray, 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 pray. from this day upwards, let me, O oh Lord, eat in plenty and be satisfied. Say, O oh Lord, from this day upwards, hey, uh, let me eat in plenty and let me be satisfied. In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, Papa, from this day upwards, I decree that I shall eat in plenty and I shall be satisfied. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, say, O oh Lord, all dissatisfaction, whatever it is, O oh Lord, that is short, that is short, changing my life. Life. Father, destroy them tonight from this day upwards. Let me eat in plenty. Let me be satisfied. Let me eat what I want to eat. Let me wear what I want to wear. Let me go where I want to go in the name of Jesus. Let me sleep where I want to sleep from this day upwards. Come and open your mouth. Say, oh Lord, allow me. Say, oh Lord, permit me. Say, oh Lord, let me. Let me eat in plenty. Let me be satisfied in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Jesus. Compulsory fasting shall not be your portion. You will eat in plenty. You know when somebody doesn't have food to eat, they will say, let me turn it into a fast. It shall not be your portion. You will fast when you want to fast, but you will eat also when you want to eat. Oh Lord, from this day I will eat in plenty. In the name of Jesus, where I keep my food will not dry up. In the name of Jesus, my refrigerator will not dry up. In the name of Jesus, my closet will have abundance of clothes in the name of Jesus. Come on, open for satisfaction. Say, Papa, satisfy me with your blessings. Come on, open your mouth. If what you ask is what God will give you. Say, satisfy me with my blessings. Satisfy me with your blessings in the name of Jesus. I like what he says. Say, oh Lord, from this day upwards. Yes, yes, that's what God said. Say, oh Lord, from this day upwards, deal wondrously with me. Deal wondrously with me. Deal wondrously with me. Let me never be brought to shame from this day forward. Old oh God, from this day forward, let me begin to see your wonders in my life from this day forward. Like never before, let me begin to see your wonders in my life. Let me begin to see your wonders in my ministry. Let me begin to see your wonders in my family. Let me begin to see your wonders on my children from this day upwards. Deal wondrously with my family. Deal wondrously with my husband, deal wondrously with my wife, deal wondrously with my children, deal wondrously with my grandchildren. Let me never be brought to shame, oh Papa. Let us never be brought to shame, oh Father. Let us never beg to eat. Let us never beg to sleep. Let us never beg to house. In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, from this day upwards, oh God of blessings, deal wondrously with me. Let me be Begin to see wonders happen in my life in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus, are you ready to pray another prayer? Say, My Father, my Father, my Father. Say, Begin to manifest yourself. Say, Begin to manifest yourself from today as the mighty El Shaddai. El Shaddai, my provider, that's his name. Say, Oh Lord, fulfill your name in my life. Fulfill your name in my business. Fulfill your name in my pro profession. Fulfill your name in my womb. Fulfill your name in my finances. Manifest, manifest, manifest yourself. Manifest yourself from today upward as the mighty El Shaddai, my provider. Be my El Shaddai. Be my provider. Let me never lack anything that is eek. Oh God, let me never lack anything that is good. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Father, manifest, manifest, manifest yourself. Manifest, manifest, manifest yourself from this day, oh Lord. As the mighty El Shaddai, be my portion, O God. Say it again, say from this day upwards, hallelujah, from this day upwards, where I have experienced dryness. Mm -hmm. 
Say, oh Lord, from this day upwards, where I have experienced dryness, let fruitfulness be the order of the day for me, O oh God, where everything has been so dry, business has been so dry, sales have been so dry, my health has been so dry, my finances have been so dry, even my spiritual life has been so dry. Say, oh Lord, from this day upwards, where I've experienced dryness, let fruitfulness be the portion and the order of the day, O oh God, in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, from this day upward, we are praying the exact words of Jesus, exact word of God, from this day upward, we have experienced, O oh God, dryness. I want you to pray for your spiritual life. Disobedience brings dryness, and when you start walking in obedience, then God, hallelujah, will begin to just manifest himself in your life, and you will become fresh, not dry. I want you to pray tonight. Every dryness in my prayer life, every dryness in my love for God, every dryness in my love for my fellow men, oh Lord, remove it from this day on in the name of Jesus. Let dryness be gone. Let fruitfulness come. Let freshness come. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. I want you to pray again, pray again, pray again, pray again. Say from this day upward. Yes, God said it. He said from this day upward. Say where I have experienced moderate blessings. I said we are all blessed. But many of us is too moderate. I want you to pray that the mighty downpour of God's blessing will be your portion. You've got moderate rain. You've got your sprinkles. I want you to pray for downpour, 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 downpour. In the name, somebody's receiving it all in the name of Jesus because they are taking this prayer serious. And that's all it takes. From this day upward, we have experienced moderate blessings, oh God. Moderate rainfall, oh God. Let your mighty downpour of your blessings be my portion in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, say from this day upward, let your blessings in my life be upward ever, downward never, upward ever, downward never, upward ever, downward never, in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, say my Lord and my God, from this day, from this day, from this day, let your blessings in my life be upward ever, downward never, upward ever, downward never, in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, forward ever, backward never, in the name of Jesus, upward ever, downward never, forward ever, backward never, in the name of Jesus, your blessings in my life, oh God, from this day, let it be upward ever, downward never, forward ever, backward never, upward ever, downward never, forward ever, Backward never. In the name of Jesus. I want you to say, Lord, I reject inconsistent high and low mode of blessings in my life. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Come and say, I reject it. I reject it. I reject it. Inconsistent. Inconsistent high and low mode of blessing. I don't want it. I want to be high, not low. Oh, Lord God, from this day on, let me be consistently blessed. Higher and higher and higher every day. I reject inconsistency in blessing. I reject high today, low tomorrow, high day after tomorrow, and low the other day. Oh Lord, I reject that mode of blessing, oh God. Let me be going higher every day, higher, higher, higher every day. In the name of Jesus, higher, higher, higher every day. Let it be our portion on this prayer line. Can I ask you to pray? Can I ask you to pray this prayer? Limitation, limitation, ah, limitation on quantity and quality. Hey, limitation on quantity and quality. You know, you can be blessed. You can be blessed now. You can be blessed. You can be blessed with a sprinkle. And then the quality is useless. I want you to pray tonight. Limitation on quantity. Limitation on quality of blessings that you can receive. Destroy it. Destroy it. Destroy it. Destroy from my life. In the name of Jesus, limitation be destroyed from my life. Come on. I hope you are praying tonight. We got just five more minutes. 
needs to go. Oh Lord, limitation on the quantity and the quality of blessings I can receive. Father, destroy the limitations from my life from this day upwards. All limitations that have been placed upon my life that limits the blessing God says he will give me. Destroy that. Be destroyed. Be destroyed. All witchcraft limitations. Be destroyed. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. All man in spirit limitations. Be destroyed. All self-imposed limitations. Be destroyed. In the name of Jesus. All the system of the world limitations. Be destroyed. In the name of Jesus. I shall have quantity. I shall have quality. I shall have quantity. I shall have quality. Quality blessing. Quantity blessing. Quality blessing. Quantity blessing. Quality blessing. Quantity blessing. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Say from this day upwards, my friends, all foundational hindrances. Hey, hey, foundational hindrances. Ah, ah, foundational hindrances. Mm. Don't let me say anything to that. But I want you to pray that from this day upwards, foundational hindrances to divine blessings, foundational hindrances to divine blessings, be destroyed from my life, be destroyed from my life, in the name of Jesus. All foundational hindrances. You met it there, oh, it was in the foundation of your life. You built on it, and you saw that this thing is not moving. I pray, I do this, I do that. Something is wrong with the foundation, my friend. And if the foundation be destroyed. What can even the righteous do? I want you to come against in the name of Jesus. I want you to come against all foundational hindrances. All foundational hindrances. Whatever has been sold into the foundation of your life by your father, by your, from your father, from your mother, from your, their own parents that have been sown into your life. Because you are from there now, you carry their DNA now. I want you to pray. Whatever is in my DNA that is fighting blessings. Pray, oh, whatever is in my DNA uh, that is causing delay. Everything I do, I must struggle. Uh, everything I do, there must be delay. Uh, oh, Lord, uh, whatever has been sown into the foundation of our lives in our family, uh, I say it in myself. I say it in my brother. I say it in my sister. I destroy it in my life. Uh, in the name of Jesus, uh, from this day upwards, uh, from this day and so forth, uh, all foundational hindrances to divine blessings uh, be destroyed, be destroyed, be destroyed, be destroyed, be destroyed, and all spiritual attacks. Come on, pray, 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 pray. All spiritual attacks that are fighting the blessings of God in your life, command them to be banished from your life. Command them to be removed from your life. Say all spiritual attacks, all spiritual attacks, all spiritual attacks that are fighting the blessings of God in my life, be destroyed. I banish you from my life. Fire, destroy them. Fire, destroy them. Fire, destroy them. Fire, destroy them. All spiritual attacks, fighting blessings in my life. Oh Lord, destroy them, destroy them, destroy them, destroy them. In the name of Jesus, I want you to pray this prayer. Say from this day upward. Yes, say from this day upward. Let my cup, my cup, let it not only be filled, but let it overflow with the blessings of God. Papa, from this day upward, let my cup not only be filled, but let it overflow, God, with your blessings in the name of Jesus. My cup be overflowing with blessings in the name of Jesus. Papa, fill my cup to overflowing in the name of Jesus. Finally, I want you to pray, oh, say blessings that eyes have never seen, blessings that my hands have never handled from this day on be released into my life. That's the last prayer point. Say blessings that my eyes have never seen, blessings that my hands have never handled begin to flow into my hand, begin to flow into my life from this day upwards. Blessings that my eyes have never seen, that my hands have never handled, begin to flow. Money, money that my eyes have never seen, that my hands have never handled, begin to flow, begin to flow, begin to flow into my life from this day upwards. In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, begin to say, Lord, I bless you. Begin to say, Lord, I thank you. Begin to say, Lord, I glorify you. In the name of Jesus, we thank you for the answers of tonight. We receive our blessings from this day upwards. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen and amen. I pray for you and I bless you. 
That every prayer that you have prayed tonight, the Lord will give it to you. The Lord will give you exceeding abundantly above that which you ask or you thought of tonight. May you be blessed. May disobedience be vanquished in your life. And may blessings replace them for you. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen. And amen, and amen, and amen. Thank you all so much for joining us tonight. Wow. Tomorrow night, oh, hey. Please, please, please. I beg of you, don't miss tomorrow night. Please, 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 don't miss it. Because if you think today is hot, tomorrow night is harder. Please join us tomorrow at 7 o'clock, New York time. We'll be here. God's peer in our lives. Shall we share the grace as we break to go and rest? May the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, the love of God, and the sweet fellowship of the Holy Spirit be with us now and forevermore. Amen and amen. Surely, goodness and mercy shall follow us all the days of our lives. We shall remain in the house of the Lord forever and ever. Amen and amen. Good night and remain blessed. <laughs>